Wake the fuck up, samurai. We have a city to burn. At least we cleared that up. We cleared that up. No worries. All right, sorry, you were saying. Jeff's office. Control room, storage, and flea market crammed into one. Take out. Tight bites. You and Jeff must be putting in serious overtime. Election. You don't even have time to think about food, so you just order whatever's quickest. But yes, it's true. Jeff hasn't eaten anything else recently. Mm. Got you. This is where Jeff saw our intruder. And fired at him here. Right after walking out of the bedroom. At least that's how he remembers it. Blood stains. Not quite scrubbed clean. Where's the blood from? It yours? I'm 100% sure it's not ours. Maybe the intruders? Probably. This is a big deal. Okay. Where's the where, what blood trails? Bullet holes? Bullet holes. Cocked up. Someone tried to patch up the bullet holes. Assuming neither of you had anything to do with this. No, of course not. I've been thinking. Yes, go on. That night at the farm and what uh, don't get me wrong, things I've oh, I'm almost always on the road. I move so fast, so my promise can't catch up me. Uh, open messages. Yeah. You're not just saying that. I'm counting on it. Can wait, smiley face. Whoa, I just see you. It's a smiley face. Anyway. Anyway, I'm working. Okay, so. Got those two. I don't see the blood trail, though. Where is this blood trail that I'm, that I'm looking at? Here? This is a very elaborate house. Why is there a gift there? Broken. What is that? It was fine a couple days ago. We rarely use it though. Oh, it's a television. Damn it. Not smart enough. Okay. Anyway. Sorry. Jesus Christ. I think we're safe putting your secure used meds. I'm sure to make a beeline here after Jeff tagged him. Talking to yourself again? Privacy. More and more. Oh! Ever since Under this terrorist. Mouth. Wonder how long they've been keeping this from you. Too long. This ends now. I'm not letting any more of those freaks set foot! Ugh. Oh, my head. Something wrong? Don't worry about me. Do what you have to do. Well, weird hardware. What's it for? 
Mm -hmm. Connected to the wall mounted screens. Wonder where else these cables run. Oh, fuck. Hmm. Is she going to die right from me? Go, let's go check on her for a bit. You okay? Is your sick ready enough? Wine cellar? Okay. Still says examine the apartment, huh? I'll be I'll, I'll be right back. Let's have a look. Files deleted. Files deleted. Huh. Very interesting. Mercenary on site. Helipad. Working space. Other angle. Wait, who the hell is that? Oh no, that's me. <laughs> I thought that was like a like a like something else, but it's actually my stupid do rag. Meeting room. Oh, happy family. Corridor. Pool. Another. Okay. Hmm. Doesn't seem like much. All the smart glasses failing. Oh, why would they need this many? Never mind. Is this all their house? Okay. Okay. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Hello. Uh, fresh gunpowder residue, recent shots fired. So he's not crazy. He didn't fire the shots out. What the hell is that? Is that a screen? For your bed? I do like the library though, nice touch. Dad's campaign. Zoshi. Oh, is that here, something for Judy? Okay. So she. Ah. Interesting. So, so Judy recommended me. 
Pan Am. Um, I'd rather be the company of stubborn ass. Uh, you know who I'm talking about. Anyway, I think he's losing out a bit, trying to realize that he doesn't have. Uh, you're right, V. Trying to make me jealous, huh? Well, not it's tempting. So it's official. Pan Am's are bright again. That's nice. Anyway, got another. We got a bigger case to solve here. Let's follow the cables. Interesting. Oh, we're really high up. Practically prehistoric, but it doesn't look older than a day. Saw something like this back in the war. Transmitters. Militech was using them. Short-range UHF. Signal only travels line of sight, but it can't be intercepted. Line of sight? Let's look around, see if we can't spot where our receiver's camping out. All right, find the transmitter source. So it's got to be something it's facing, huh? There it is. Got a vision the receiver. Black van parked next to it. Got to be our winner. Transmitters within reach of our mystery van. Wonder if Elizabeth has ever seen the car. Imagine I go in and Elizabeth's dead. Elizabeth? Hey. Liz, this is way bigger than we thought. Jeff's entire campaign could be threatened. Let me worry about the race. Just tell me what you managed to find. There's a transmitter on the roof. It seems to be conveying a signal to a van out front. You know who it might be? We never set up any transmitter. And I don't know a thing about any van, but my guess is it's SSI's. Could be. Could be. The tech they're using seems unconventional, though. Do you plan to check it? I do. Yeah. About to pay them a personal visit. I'll wait here. Just don't tell Jeff anything for now, okay? Sure. Whatever. I'll call him once I know something more substantial. That's fine. Just remember it's the busiest time for Jeff right now. You can always come and talk to me. Gotcha. Fine. I'll keep that in mind. Man, is this getting really out of hand? <laughs> Interesting. Very interesting. All right, let's go look for that surveillance. Surveillance. Oh, so, oh no. Surveillance van. Whew. Who would have thought we stumbled across across something like this? How about we take the wheels, V? That van could give us a slip any second. You know what, Johnny? You're right. Oh, I can go into third person again as well. Sorry. Weirdly enough, they can the car and the like the bike, everything controls better in first person. Oh, 
definitely not your ordinary van. It's not a turret on top. About to find out. Follow? Interesting. Is it gonna like speed away? Don't lose him, V. I got you. Oh, now you're interested. We could expose a corporal conspiracy here, V. I'm telling you. They could it's be got you. spies or who the fuck knows what. Oh, got you hot under the collar, eh, Johnny? Haha. <laughs> Man, I'm leaving tire marks everywhere. Night City getting ruined. Being taken for a run around here. That's good. Bet you thought you lost me. Man, that was some like police chase shit. You look at politicians and see a curated display, but behind the scenes it's all out war. Citizens don't choose their representatives. Then who? The key players, string pullers. They spy on all the paralysis, look for weak spots, blackmail, rig elections. Oh, they're getting very far. All right, time to, time, time to guess it. Oh, it's not as fast as I thought. Was this where we dropped uh, Jesse Cox off? Oh shit, there's billions of them. Mm. Wow, we got blown up immediately. Jesus Christ. There might have been a small fire. Okay, we may have to take the, uh, the smart rifle out. What do you guys... They were very spongy, holy shit. Alright. Off the bike. Okay. We gotta fight our hands on. Free shot shooting him. Alright, turn to run. Ho 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 ho. Jeez Louise, okay. Uh, 
Char incendiary blood pump. Biohazard grenade, EMP grenade, frag grenades. I got 51 of them. How am I fire? Like that, thank you. Okay. That sorted him out. Someone in here? Oh, that dude nearly ruined me. Oh, ay, 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 ay. Okay. All right, now we're uninterrupted. Interesting. Interesting tech you got here. Pierce did we're in. Couldn't ask the NCPD for better records than this. Uh-huh. Pictures, medical records, vulnerability to neuroplasticity. Some kind of database. Brain scans, the paralysis, biological casts, neuroplasticity. Fuck. What about that? The blue shit. Fresh neural links. They're not spying on them, Johnny. They're fucking with their heads. Oh, fuck. You mean to say someone's literally controlling our upstanding politicians' minds? Hell yeah. Red blots are memory residue in the hippocampus region. See how they're bleeding into the blue? So what are we looking at? Ooh, Johnny's very invested in this. Modifying their personalities. This is big shit, Johnny. Fuck me. Got other guinea pigs besides the paralysis, too. Quick, download the data. Whoever comes looking for it, that's your suspect. Shit. They're wiping the data. We've been made. Now they know someone's been in their database. Wonder if they also know who. What? Isn't that the question of the day, then? V, do you have any news? Gonna want to sit down for this. It's um, it's way bigger than we thought. What is? You're being brainwashed. Literally, they've scanned your minds now, used to some kind of conditioning to. Wait, not on the hollow. Right, I'll come by. No, you and I, we need to speak alone. Why? A little ramen place in Japan Town, sending you the coordinates. Right. See you there. Why alone? Elizabeth, I don't like I don't like that sound. I don't like it when people say go meet me alone. It's usually a precursor for something like it's usually a precursor for something, you know, schemey. Don't like schemes. Uh Right. Japan town it is. What about the uh, fucking pretty boy? What's his name? Jefferson. He has the right to know. Why is it gonna be us two only? This is all very suspicious, Elizabeth. Oh, it's this place. Is that guy still selling, selling samurai stuff? No. 
Wait, I got a job called Sweet Dreams. But I'm doing Dream On. Anyway, uh, let's go to handguns. Let's get some handgun stuff. Is that her? Will you sit? Please. Wow, you 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 look different. Thank you for coming. A different character model. Why are we meeting here and not at your pad? Because I have something to confess. In private, not in front of Jeff. Okay, confess. Go on then. Tell me. I, I'm sorry. My nerves are shot. I can't gather my thoughts. Has something happened since the last time we met? long ago since we last met. Something happened since then? No, I mean, something did happen, though not recently. Something stinks here. It's a long story. I don't quite know how to tell you. Where to even start? No rush. Relax, no need to rush. Ah. <sighs> Oh, that looks horrible. Uh, uh, a while ago, I started noticing some changes in Jeff's behavior. His personality, he seemed to be changing right in front of me, becoming someone else. How so? He stopped reading, forgot the title of his favorite movie. Even his musical taste changed overnight. I think I might have the answer to that. I said we should visit his brother's grave. And he told me that he'd been an only child. That's when I started thinking something bad was happening. Something insidious. And not just with Jeff. Notice any changes in yourself. Notice any changes in yourself. After some time, on I couldn't turn them off. Friends pointed out that I was acting strangely. That must have been hard. It was. You know, it's at times like those you start to question reality. So, you knew what I was going to find. So the whole time, you knew what I could end up finding. I don't know who, how, or why, but they are changing us. That concealed room in our apartment. What about it? I'm sure I'd seen it before, but must have somehow forgotten. Okay. I find that terrifying. Have you talked to Jeff yet? Mention any of this. Wow, Jeff. she's very paranoid. She keeps looking around the back. I tried. I did. But he's blinded to everything. He just laughed, said I was imagining things. He once brought up a vacation that we never went on. Swear to God. He went okay. on about it in such detail. I almost started believing him. Could be just you who forgot. Maybe they wiped the trip from God the damn it, not the time. Hell, I don't know anymore. Don't you get that? Is that it? Is there anyone you else? You told me the whole story yet, have you? I saw a stranger in our apartment one night tinkering with the monitors. But I was in such a state by then that I didn't know if I could trust my own eyes. So you didn't do anything? I don't remember what happened. I talked to security the next morning. And you got nothing out of it. Let me guess. Cams didn't pick anything up. The guy just shrugged and said I must have dreamt it. He showed me the recording, of course. I felt like a lunatic. And then, the next day, I got a call. Who was it? Them. Whoever they are. There okay. Was a garbled voice on the other end. He never introduced himself. Cut a deal? And? You cut some kind of deal with him? No. I was told that our perfect lives could fall apart at any minute. That I have my husband's safety to think about. After, there was no record of the call. It was as if it had never happened. So I'm begging you, V. Jefferson can't find out about any of this, ever. His life depends on it. 
could be you're saying what you've been programmed to say. What if you're just saying what they programmed you to say? Just reading off a script based on thoughts planning in your head. All I know is I love my husband and I want him to be safe and and happy. But that's what they want you to know. You know what Jeff will do if you tell him? I know my husband. He'll start looking on his own. He All right. can't find out about this. It it destroy him. Okay, okay, okay. You were lying the whole time. You knew who sent the intruder, but just strung me along anyway, Liz. I didn't have a choice. I didn't know what to do. You wanted everything just to go on and flow on because it was convenient. Convenient? You got the perfect life. Prominent husband. You don't lack for a thing. You think I'm having fun? You have no idea what it's like living like this. You think Jeff will pick a fight he can't win then? You think if I tell him everything that he'll go and pick a fight he can't win? I don't just think. I know. One thing hasn't changed. Jeff's still a fighter. And he'll go down swinging. Mm -hmm. So how do we play this? I'm going to tell Jeff that SSI was spying for his rival, Holt. You just need to confirm what I say. Really prepared to fight? No, okay, what if I'm not on board? And if I'm not on board? You have a choice. Just remember, any consequences will not be yours to deal with. Are you really prepared to fire SSI then? You're truly prepared to fire SSI? After the threats. It'd be brave, but risky as all get out. What they're doing to us is one thing, but when you found that concealed room, I can't accept strangers spying on us while we sleep. Not under my own roof. What difference does it make where? I'll take full responsibility for anything SSI goes on to do. I'm just asking you not to get Jefferson involved. Hmm. I'll add a meeting in Reconciliation Park to Jeff's schedule. He'll be waiting. Since I can't know if I'll remember this conversation tomorrow, I'm counting on you not to forget what I asked of you. I won't. But that's all I can promise. Fine. Goodbye, V. Ma'am? All things fucked up, huh? Wouldn't want to be in her pants. Speaking of, overlapping memories, changing personalities. Remind you of anything? But hey, at least we know what we're up against. Um... What would you have done then? So, in my pants, what would you do? Some real rat bastards behind this. Someone's got to take them down. Even by risking the paralysis lives. Fuck knows what kind of shit a mayor controlled by puppet masters could pull. But yeah, you could end up putting their lives at risk. Or not. Tough choice, V. We'll see, won't we? Oh dear. Shit. Mind if I just peruse? And you're not gonna buy anything. What the fuck is all this shit? Oh, I guess she's got like upgrade parts. Uh, right, let's go meet with Jefferson then. I don't know. Should we tell him that that some evil organizations after him? I don't believe it. Oh god damn it. Well Well that has just happened. Mother Damn it. For, well, to be fair, this is the first crash in about five hours. So, not too bad, all things considered. Still, though, it's a crash nonetheless. <laughs>